that everybody has their stories everyone has their lives you know just because i'm an addict don't mean that i'm not human <laughs> Yes, I have an addiction, yes, I have a problem, but that doesn't make me anything less than what anyone else is, you know? I've had experience with not just one, but multiple. Um, my best friend, he actually is an older man, and he's kind of like the person that's been helping take care of me since I've been out here, because I kind of got stranded out here in Alamosa. And at first it was kind of like experimental. He wanted to, you know, try it, whatever, whatever, because he gets high regardless on his own, you know. So me being, you know, his best friend, whatever, I did it still that way. Because I care, I didn't want him to get hurt, you know. At least somebody was there that can actually stand by and actually help him or be prepared to help him or some kind of way. Or just, instead of him just like dying or getting left, you know, by himself. So, you know, I went along with it or whatever. And he totally just like hit the ground every time that I've tried this with him. And I mean, it doesn't matter the, the amount that I have gave him or whatever when it comes to the drugs. But he uh, totally just, he's just not the kind of person that, you know, can handle that kind of thing but anyway so the first time you know he went down or whatnot and I had this is when they used to give you the liquid um, naloxone or whatever so I had to pop the little like you know safety cap off and I didn't realize it but you know I'm like he's like on the ground and turn of purple and stuff and like you know I was just like oh my god panicking you know what I mean I didn't know what to do because like this is the first time I've ever had the experience with somebody with you know an overdose and so I'm like, oh my God, what do I do? What do I do? You know, and I'm over there like, just hang on, I got you, nigga, I got you. You know, thinking I was like, okay, well, I got that, you know, stuff or whatever to to help him out. And I went and, and I grabbed it because I had like in the basket in my room, just like sitting there, it's been there forever, you know. And I popped, I, I forgot that I had like the safety top, you know. So I'm like stabbing, trying to stab through the plastic part on the top you know and I'm like I couldn't get through it and I'm like oh shit what does you know it has a plastic top you know so I, I get it off eventually you know and I figure it out and you know I, I give it to him and honestly he came back to me within seconds like it was pretty amazing like how how fast it worked and how good it worked because honestly he, he was pretty purple like I thought he was done for for sure I was already like thinking in my head, well, I'm gonna have to make arrangements to like call the cops and like kind of get somebody over here to help me because I didn't know what to do at that point, you know. But I, that dawned on me, I had that, so thank God, you know. And yeah, so I did, it helped me a lot to help him out.